welcome to the year 1934. The United States is in the middle of the Great Depression, meaning millions are out of work and struggling to survive. And people are hoping that President Franklin Roosevelt will save them from their extreme poverty. But, despite all of these hardships, Americans are also enjoying some great entertainment. Flash Gordon and Little Orphan Annie comics are read by children everywhere. Disney has begun to work on Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Shirley Temple has just hit the big screen. And Cornelia Manks has just won the Newbery Award for Invincible Louisa, the story of the author of Little Women. Now, Meigs first garnered Newbery attention in 1922, the first year the Newbery was awarded, when her book The Wendy Hill was named as an honor book. But Invincible Louisa garnered the ultimate prize with its novel-like telling of the life of Louisa May Alcott, author of the classic Little Women, the unforgettable story of the four March sisters growing up towards their separate destinies in 19th century Massachusetts. Louisa actually fashioned the character of Jo Marge after her own life as a strong and independent woman uh, coming from a family rich in transcendental ideals and love, but not so much in money, who then goes on to pursue her lifelong dream of becoming a writer when most women were expected to pursue a life of a traditional wife and mother. So, if you're looking for a true classic and engaging biography, I give you Invincible Louisa, the true story of a young woman who became an inspiration and heroine for generations of readers who were able to find themselves and their own sisters in the treasured adventures of Joe, Meg, Beth, and Amy.